Hi, welcome back to another quick guide. Today I'll teach you how to remove all bloatware Windows 11. And it's literally an easy process, so make sure to watch until the end of the video to know how it's done. To initiate the process, first navigate to the Jethub website at jethub.com. I'll locate the specific application called this is Win11. You can't easily find the direct link in the description down below. Right click on the provided link and go for save link as. Choose the designated folder on your system where you want the download to be stored and then click on save. As a download progresses, it can take a moment to customize the icon's appearance to your preferences. Once the file has been successfully downloaded, right click on it and choose the option Extract All, followed by clicking on Extract. This step is essential to access the application's contents. Post Extraction, right click on New Created Folder and choose the Administrative option. Run as administrator, this ensures that you have the necessary privileges to make system level changes. Upon reaching the home page of the website, explore the upper left corner of the screen, where you'll find a variety of tools. Click on apps, situated in the same corner, under the section titled, Show System Apps, you'll be presented with a list detailing the number of apps that required removal. By selecting Move All, you effectively initiate the process of transferring these identified apps into the recycle bin. Should you wish to handle individual apps, you have the flexibility to do so. Simply select the specific app and choose Restore Selected. This action moves the app back to the Show System Apps section, giving you control over each app's fate. Once you've made your tailored selections, proceed to click on Empty Bean. Confirm this action by clicking Yes. Exercise patience during this phase as the system diligently works to remove the chosen applications. After the completion of the process, take note that while 77 apps were initially plugged for removal, a successful removal count stands at 64. It's crucial to acknowledge that certain apps may not be removed due to various reasons, such as active usage, during the removal attempt or underlying issues within the app itself. Your understanding of these factors ensures a smoother experience throughout this process. And that's all for now folks, hope you like and subscribe, thank you.